Hello viewers, I hope all of you are fine. Let's discuss our today very interesting and basic topic which is cathode ray oscilloscope. But before discussing this topic, please subscribe this channel for upcoming very interesting videos about nature exploration, environment, science and physics. So let's discuss our today topic which is cathode ray oscilloscope. What is cathode ray oscilloscope? Basically, it is called CRO, means cathode ray oscilloscope. It is a high speed graph plotting device which is used for a display of waveform or a graph of a particular function. For example, if we want to display the graph of the voltage signal, then we can use CRO, where that waveform is in circuit form, sinusoidal form, or square wave, or any kind of. So, cathode ray oscilloscope is basically a high speed graph plotting device with the help of which we can display waveform of a particular signal. Now, let's discuss its different components. Cathode ray oscilloscope consists of filament which basically indirectly, indirectly heated this cathode. Whenever we heat up this filament, it emits electrons, and these electrons are negatively charged particles. That's why it is called cathode ray oscilloscope because here cathode rays are emitted. Now, how we can control these electrons with the help of grid G? Basically, grid is a negative, negatively charged uh, potential with the help of which we can control the brightness of spark on screen as well as we can control the number of electrons that are emitted from cathode. Or filament to C. <clears throat> now, in order to focus their beam on the screen, we use here a nodes A1, A2, A3. Basically, these nodes act as an accelerated potential because a node is positively charged plate and electrons are negatively charged, so that's why it attracts the electrons or accelerates the electron towards the uh, screen. Now, we can move this beam up and down left right with the help of these deflecting players. There are two kinds of are two set of players here in cathode ray oscilloscope which are basically the X players and the Y players. With the help of X players we can deflect the uh, beam of the electron along X axis and with the help of Y uh, deflecting players we can deflect the beam of the electron along Y axis. So it means that we can uh, obtain our desired signal with the help of this arrangement. Now, if we are interested in order to get the sinusoidal waveform, then it means that we have to apply the voltage along uh, y axis as well as the time based voltage along x axis. The time based voltage, uh, with the help of time based voltage that is applied along x axis, we can speak the electrical signal along, along x axis. Once when the waveform is displayed on cathode ray oscilloscope screen, for example, this sort of voltage or this sinusoidal voltage, then we can easily determine the peak value of the voltage, the instantaneous value of the voltage, which is L or F. We can easily determine the peak and sinusoidal value of voltage, the frequency of particular voltage or current signal the phase of particular voltage or current signal, the time period of particular voltage or current signal, and also the phase difference of particular voltage or current signal, you can easily determine all of these different parameters with the help of cathode ray oscilloscope. But necessary condition for that is uh, first we have to display the waveform of that particular signal. Then after that, we can easily obtain the frequency, phase, time period has different relationship between two electrical segments and twice and so on. So I hope you learned very basic interesting uh, information about cathode ray oscilloscope. I can repeat some a little bit about this again. Cathode ray oscilloscope is basically a high speed, uh, high speed graph plotting device with the help of which we can obtain waveform or we can display the graph of a particular function on a screen. Uh, or for example, in this case, we can obtain the waveform of a particular voltage signal 
uh, which is either in startup form or in serial serial form or in uh, rectangular or uh, square views uh, we can also show the phase difference between two uh, electrical signals so this is a high speed graph plotting device and the working uh, principle of this is uh, like this where the uh, filament uh, emit electrons and then we can control the beam of that electron with the help of uh, grid G and uh, also focus uh, their beam of electron with the help of anode and uh, focus their beam of electron or deflect elastics and what X is their beam of electron with the help of uh, these uh, deflecting players. Thanks for your time. Please subscribe this channel for further upcoming interesting videos. Once again, thank you.